uh, what is CSM through? CSM through uses the sum of the area under parabola as an approximation for the value of the area under the curve y equals to fx. So to find the area under the curve y equals to fx, between x equals to a and x equals to b, you must first divide the area into an even number n of suites, each of which h equals to b minus a over n. And then we have to number and evaluate the ordinate y0, y1, y2, yn. And after that, the area to the curve is then given by h over 3, y0, y plus yn plus 4 bracket, y1 plus y3 plus yn minus 1 bracket plus 2 bracket y2 plus y4 plus n minus 2. Okay, when compared to trapezoidal rule, the formula to finding the area is different. The formula for using trapezoidal rule is h over 2 bracket y0 plus yn plus 2 bracket y1 plus y2 plus yn minus 1 close bracket. And using the sum of the area of this strip, as an approximation for the actual value of the area we have. So, the advantage and the disadvantage of trapezoidal rule and Simpson's rule. For Simpson's rule, it's more accurate, but however, the n can only be even number. So if you're trying to solve an odd number, you can't solve it. And for trapezoidal rule, the advantage is you can solve it even though it's odd number or even number. But however, it's less accurate than symptoms grew. Thank you.